Okay guys, today I'm gonna be sharing um, a video of a little bit of a meet and greet that I went to and also Darlene's discount that I've been telling you about and a little bit of a haul or a haul from there. It's a pretty good haul. It's almost a hundred dollars worth of stuff. But I had recorded another intro and I don't know what happened to it. I'm still getting used to this camera. Maybe I didn't record it. Maybe something else happened. I don't know. But anyway, this is hours and hours later when I was just sitting down to edit and I can't find the intro. So here it is. And where that you're gonna see me start now is whenever I'm talking about going to Darlene's, but I do have a tiny bit of the meet and greet situation. It was a YouTuber meet and greet, but I mainly went to meet Stacy from um, Fat Man and Big Mama. That was the main reason I went. I did know of some of the other YouTubers. I knew of one for sure, but because um, I watch her, She's a much bigger channel than me, but I didn't really know of the others. And then the other one that I knew about, they were like a way big, long line. <laughs> but anyway, I mainly went to meet Stacy, and um, so I'm just sharing a little bit of that. And you will see from the point that I have on, because I didn't record much at the meet and greet. I think I said that. Anyway, here we go. Okay, so now we're going to Darlene's Discount and Stacy and Bo and Carol Beth are gonna go there too. I'm gonna try to record there. Um, they told me I could before, but I just didn't ever have my camera and I'm gonna show y'all Darlene's store. And um, then we're gonna go to Tractor Supply and we're going to Food Outlet. And um, I'm not gonna show you all of that. I'm just gonna show you Darlene's. And I don't know what we're going to get from Darlene. I'm pretty sure we'll get something, but we don't have anything specific that we're planning on getting. But, um, Stacy is just the same as you see her on her videos in real life. She's the same exact person. You don't get any difference with her. She's, um, and so is Bo, Fat Man. He's the same, too. They're really, they're really sweet. Oh, look at that. Bo's like a beetle. Oh, well. I took my glasses off because there was a glare, but I can't see without them because distance. But anyway, Jeff is driving. Of course, I'm not driving while doing this. And um, we're going to see y'all whenever we get to Darlene's. Music base doing all that. No, no. We just, we just here yammering. Just here. Now, we could be. I mean, we could be standing here. Yeah. We're YouTubers. <laughs> Yeah, so we can put it on my YouTube. I asked last time we were over here so I could put it on my YouTube channel because I actually have somebody that's already come up here because of it. Because of my videos. Where are y'all from? Montgomery. Montgomery. But yeah, she, uh, they're actually on their way here now because we just saw them and they're, they're coming here okay. now. But they were up here it was either last week or the week before. I can't remember, but she put it on her YouTube channel too. But she didn't record anything inside. She just showed what she got at home like I did. Oh, okay. So. Hey, that and Facebook, we do Facebook Live. Yeah, I don't have you know? Facebook, but she does. Stacy does. And she has, um, she's checked it out on there. But I don't have Facebook, but I do have YouTube. And there's a lot of people like to see what I got. And I said, oh, well, I'll share the store next time if I can. Yeah. So I asked permission and they said, go ahead.
What you doing? Oh, you, you getting space? I was filming. <laughs> <laughs> we have to buy that one. Buy it all.
Okay, so we're back from Darlene's and the meetup, and we went to Tractor Supply. We just got rabbit and chicken feed, and we went by Food Outlet, which you should have. You'll see that haul next week with the Sam stuff. Anyway, but I'm gonna go ahead and show you this stuff. I was not gonna do a haul with this, but I'm just gonna go ahead and show you because I don't think I did very well in the store. So hopefully I showed you Darlene's okay. I don't think it is that great, but I did have a great day talking with Stacy and um, her husband and daughter, and um, it was really fun. It's Fat Man and Big Mama, and their daughter's name is Carol Beth, which they have more than one child. They have three or four. I've got to still get to know her a little bit better. Um, and I've also got to text her to let her know to put her catfish in the freezer. <laughs> because last time she forgot. It was sad. Okay, so I'm going to show you this stuff and tell you the prices. And we spent around not quite $100. But we got a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. So here we go. Okay, I'm going to start over here, and I don't think I've ever done a grocery haul with this camera before, so we're going to try this, and hopefully I won't ruin it. Um, we got some Reynolds Wrap Heavy Duty 75 square foot. That's the really long one. Um, it was $3.50, and then we got another one that is the shorter one that's 50 square foot for $3. So, um, they're both heavy, du heavy duty, uh, so we're going to put that in the stockpile. All right, we got this Hamburger Helper 3 Cheese. They were $1.75 for the twin pack, so it's really just two. They don't expire until next year. And it says you can also try it with chicken instead of ground beef. So we got two of those. We're going to try them. We got this Kraft Macaroni and Cheese boxes that were $0.50 cent each. They're just barely out of date. You use your own judgment whenever you buy things like this. I've never had a problem with their stuff, so we got that. Jeff wanted this California French style Piggly Wiggly um, dressing. It was 50 cent. Got this Coleslaw Hidden Valley Ranch. It was $2 for that one. And we know that was cheaper because the little trick I told y'all about, if you have the Walmart app, you can compare prices at Walmart compared to wherever else and see if you're getting a better deal. And everything I got is a better deal than Walmart. So, I got some more of these Quaker Mini Oats. These do not expire until, I want to say 2024. No, it's next year. But either way, $2.50, they're normally five. Got these Chunky Sirloin Burger and Country Vegetable Soups. Uh, they were a dollar each. And I know I saved pretty good bit, but they don't expire until 2023. It won't focus, maybe. It doesn't like it. There we go. 2023 in June. So we got over a year for that. And these, some of them are bent up, but that's okay. We didn't save a whole lot on this, but anything is saving. 50 cent is saving. These do not expire until 2023. Noah has been drinking one of these about every two days. He's been drinking this pineapple juice quite a bit. So we went ahead and grabbed all that they had. They had seven. There were $2.50 each. And then we got some more of this Legs Custom Blend Seasoning for sausage. You don't have to just use it for pork. You can use it for other things. This is not the hot one like we got last time. It was $2. So we got four of those. Um, see if I can show you all four. Okay. We got these mixed chili beans, kidney, and pinto beans. I usually put kidney and pinto beans in mine anyway. Or actually, no. I put cannellini beans. I don't usually put pinto beans, but that's okay. Um, or maybe I do. I don't know. Possibly. They were a dollar a can. It's not folk. There we go. But that's Bush's brand. That's a really good brand. All right, we got two cream of celery for 69 cent each. And I kind of got that one a little bit popped. We may have to use it pretty quick. But it's not open. It's just up a little bit. Um, and I guess we did that whenever I took it out of the bag. All right, those were 69 cent. This tomato sauce for Hunt's was 50 cent. And it's still good till 2023. This Nutella is good until 2023, and it was $3. I don't know if that was a great price or not. I just know Noah likes it, and we don't have any. So, um, or we've got one. It's the Aldi brand. He does not like it. Um, and I'm going to use it to make cookies or something, and he'll eat it that way. I mean, he'll eat it anyway, but I got him the kind he likes. 
This tomatoes, okra, and corn is something Jeff likes. Sometimes whenever we don't have enough side dishes left and we have plenty of meat, he'll take this in uh, his lunchbox. And it was a dollar. It's still good until 2024. We got four of the Hunt's crushed tomatoes. Um, that recipe that I did, the three cheese manicotti, it uses crushed tomatoes. So I grabbed some. They were $1.50 each. They're $2 at Walmart. And I'm rounding up that's really $1.98, but still. We got this Lipton Recipe Secret Savory Urban Garlic um, Soup and Dip Mix for $0.75. Cent. I think there's two packets in each one. How many? Yes, two packets in each one. We got four of those. And we got this New York Bakery Zesty Italian Croutons for $0.75. Cent. We like those, or I do. We got this Tennessee Mountain Sourwood Honey. Um, it's raw and unpasteurized. It was $12.99. Doesn't like the camera, or the camera doesn't like it. But anyways, we got that because we love honey. And we can also reuse the jar. Two of these Hunt's 100% natural tomato ketchup. Selena really likes this thicker and richer one. And they'll be good until next year. That's the date, it's 2023. And I got some Snickers that were $2.50. Didn't need them, but I got them anyway. And they're good until next year. They won't be here that long. <laughs> what was that face? Shh, he's being mean again. Let me fix this thing. He taught me how to make it work. To where my arm gets longer. <laughs> it doesn't really. Anyway, did you have fun today? Uh, yes. You don't know? Well, you want to have fun. What, do you, what does that mean? You didn't have fun? Yeah. Okay, then. <laughs> He's crazy. We still have not found our banana peppers. We're going to go look for some of those. And uh, we got to get some more stuff. For the garden and we got to get the garden tilled up so when are we doing that <laughs> when we get time um anyway i will see y'all next time and <laughs> what are you looking like that for what do i want like goofball like confused I am. he's confused all right so anyway that is all we have for today I enjoyed meeting Stacy and her family or part of her family today. And like I said, she's exactly the same as she is on her videos. And if you don't believe me, just talk to her for five minutes. <laughs> so I'll see y'all next time. Thank you for coming along with us. And remember, don't take any wooden nickels and be sweet. What was that?